guys, but you can't guess what I'm doing right now. Can you? Oh, you're so smart. I'm riding an elephant. That's what it sounds like. I'm not keeping up with her. <laughs> hey, Pam! <Whoa. laughs> guys, Ginger's here. Woohoo! I should have said that before I turned the camera. By the way, I'm just the weirdo next door. <laughs> um, so there's this chick on the treadmill next to me. She's kind of weird. <laughs> hey, guys. I have to try to make myself look better somehow. <laughs> no, this is me. I just went running and I sweat. I, I do. I'm a girl and I sweat. So disgusting, I know. I'm at the gym and Ginger's with me. She came all the way from Idaho to visit me for the week and, and I'm, I'm so excited. Sweaty. <laughs> We're working out together. It's really fun because I don't normally have a partner to work out with on a regular basis. So when I moved here, Carly's been coming with me and now Ginger's with me and Shay's been coming with me every once in a while. In the past, I just went by myself. And so I was kind of in that mode of like working out by myself. But I like having somebody with me because it helps push me. As long as we don't chit chat the I whole know. time. We're like, hey guys. Let's talk about everything while we're riding in a 7.0, okay? <laughs> but you do have to stay focused. That's the one thing about going to the gym with a partner is you still have to like stay focused, which can be really difficult. I'm not distracting, come on. <laughs> what do you prefer? Do you prefer going with somebody or Definitely. doing by yourself? Well, I like to go with somebody. It depends though if I want to talk or not. But <laughs> like normally I like to meet someone there to hold me accountable and like it's, the alarm goes off at five, I'm like, I don't want to go. Five? But I know M. she's coming, ah! you know, then I'm like, I'm going. Would you say that it helps to go with somebody that's at your same level or that somebody that you... I don't think it matters. It's different. I think the biggest thing is just getting there for me. Yeah. So it doesn't matter what they can do or whatever. I just do my own thing mm -hmm. and we just kind of get on the same rhythm and then they do what they can do and I do what I can do, but it's getting there that's like 90% of the battle. You guys, just go to the gym. Grab a partner, come on, friend, <laughs> and go work out. So this is the part of the workout where we're like, I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> you do not stop, because you cannot have that chocolate bar today if you do not. Just I wasn't going to have it anyway. <laughs> Ginger actually hasn't had sugar for how long? Well, I had one chocolate egg last night, like the little ones. One. See, and I'm like, but two I only really had one half of the bag, that's it. I know. <laughs> You had yeah. one. Really no, good. but really, for like a few weeks, right? A couple. See, for me that's huge because I'm a huge sugar lover. Oh, it's ridiculous. Like, I usually have sugar at least once a day. And so for me, even cutting out it out a day is big. And I need to stop because I realize that I'm gonna give myself diabetes. My new goal is to be like Ginger and to lay off of the sugar. So I'm gonna go, I'm going to commit right now. For how long? How long, <laughs> huh? Huh? A week. A week. Can I do it? Yes. Even with you here? Yes. Going out to eat? I'm not going to eat anything that's I not know. lettuce. Seven days, it's easy. No I'm saying chocolate. no sugar, but this means like refined sugar, like chocolate, candy, <sighs> ice cream, milkshakes. You can have sugar if it comes from watermelon. Right. Natural that's sugar. That's it. Plus, we went to this like all vegan place to eat the other day. I have to admit, I was like, I don't want to go there. Shay and Allie were like, let's go to Leaf. It's this vegan place. I'm like, vegan? Ugh. I just want a cheeseburger. <laughs> but we went, and they had the best natural, raw, organic, sugarless ice cream. It was amazing. It was amazing. So it was sugarless? I think so. Was it carbless? I think there was <laughs> sugar in it. It was like, it was made out of coconut, cashews, Stuff that like actually that. sounds good. I'm gonna tell myself that that's the one thing I can have. But all other sugars are out. <laughs> you can do it one day. It's week. natural. It's easy. So I can eat it. Yeah. Seven days. I'm committing. Here I go. You guys are probably like, really? Sugar? Anyways, that's my weakness. So you guys can join me on that. We're outside the music studio. And I was gonna talk more about how I'm not eating sugar. But instead I'm gonna talk about how I'm not colorblind. She totally is because this is purple. Purple. It looks bluish to me, like no, a navy blue. No, no, no. That Could is have so some la purple. lavender tinty. See, see, navy blue in the jeans, purple in the jacket. It's Eight. a different shade of blue. Vote. <laughs> Do it. Because I am so right on this. Against your face. Oh, you're so beautiful in purple. <laughs> My sister and I used to have this argument all the time. I got a dress for Easter that was a flower lavenderish tint, but I thought it was blue. 
And then it took me years and years and years to agree with her, and now I think it's purple. Copyright. But I don't agree with you. It might take a couple years. <laughs> Either way, Ginger, I love you. Okay. And you look beautiful in your blue coat. Ah! Ah! Let's ask Shay. We didn't ask Shay though. Yeah, we're gonna ask Shay. It's purple! No. You both are colorblind! What has LA done to you? It's a bluish purple. <laughs> so, I, can, it, I can see the purple scar. argument. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can see the purple argument, but it's... it's. I would say blue offhand, yeah. Uh, okay, what color are you wearing? This is uh, red. <laughs> Oh, stupid. <laughs> oh. Volume vortex. Yeah. Now we're getting ready to film the podcast. Mm. Um, I just wanted to let Shay know about my goal. Shay, I'm Sh not going to have sugar I heard for about seven this days. Goal. I heard about this goal. Do you really think you're going to be able to do it? Yes. Okay, so what do you mean no sugar? Like no graham crackers? I don't know. Does so no, no candy count? for sure then. Well, do you eat graham crackers? Gum? I have been completely off like carbohydrates for a week. And oh my gosh! No okay, sugar. I'm not doing that one. Wait, it's Valentine's Day. <laughs> <laughs> guess I'll yeah. guess I'll take that 18 pound box of chocolates oh. back to no. Stovers. No, I'll Stovers? hold it. I'll that hold it stuff. until after the seven no, days. No, I'm taking it back. I can't no. receipt. A commitment's a commitment. Colette. No sugar. Oh, yeah. Buy me the box of chocolates, or you're not getting anything <laughs> for Valentine's I, I, listen, Day. I'm not stupid. <laughs> You're getting you're getting a lot of chocolate tomorrow. Don't worry about it. But I'm not. You guys, going she's to not eat doing it. the no sugar thing. Just so. But you I'm know. not going to eat it yet. I'm not going to eat it. I can do this. If I can it's do Valentine's it. It's Valentine's Day. You should start after Valentine's if Day. If you can run a flipping marathon, I can go without sugar for seven days. Can you watch your freaking language? I said flipping. <laughs> Flip. <laughs>